what's up guys welcome to the channel this is the first vlog that we're doing that is not Disneyland related if you haven't caught the Disneyland ones they are linked beside you they should be if they're not they will come up at the end of the video so today it's currently quarter to eight at night and um, so it was my day off today so I didn't really do much apart from the gym but what else to do in your day off is go to work and watch a basketball game doesn't that sound like good fun so we're going to watch the Dundalk Ravens under 18's team we already know we're representing let's go Ravens see you in a bit like and subscribe don't forget it What's up guys, it's Elijah and Daniel here, down with the Ravens, we're getting dubs out here, we're and by Joss, we're getting dubs, for Alan's vlog, we're getting dubs out here, welcome to Dundalk. So as you can see, easy win for the Ravens, made it a lot harder than it should have been, but very good, very good to watch. Brought the main man with me, didn't I? Of course he did. So the main man was with me, we both watched the game, what did you think of the game, did you like it? Honestly lads. It was easy money for the Ravens. Easy money. Easy money. Who, was, who, who do you think played the best out of all the boys? Dallas. Dallas, yeah. Dallas had up, didn't he? Yeah. It's just too big. It's just <laughs> too big. Can't yeah. deal with it. Ended up being a 60 plus point win. Could have been more. Could have been a lot, lot more if they had it. Maybe 119. Yeah. They could, probably could have gone for 200 if they wanted. Could have gone for 200 if they wanted. But anyway. Less of that. Mortis. We are waiting on Hannah. Banana Katana. Which is one of the main things I do. <laughs> waiting on Hannah. Yeah. Pick her up, take her somewhere she needs to go. Because I am a living taxi. So yeah, we are waiting on Hannah. Hannah's finishing work now in about 10 minutes, 5 minutes. And we will probably go get food. After we go get food, probably go to bed. Because I am tired. <laughs> and we'll catch up tomorrow see you later so just back from dropping hannah to work the plan for today is to tidy up all that mess there and then take the dog for a walk which i'll take you with me i have to introduce you to the dog first though otherwise you get all freaked out so clear that up and then I will be with you. So, room cleaned. Now it's time to introduce you to the lady. She is in the kitchen. A few moments later. Come here. Come here. Hello. Oh, oh, oh. Now, say hello to everyone. Say hello. Can you shake hands? Yeah. So we're gonna take Lady on a walk. All right. You go for a walk. You wanna go for walkies? Yeah. Catch up a bit. So we are here. We are at Feed, which is an area just outside Dundalk in the Ravensdale area, just past the Sportsman there. If you know where we am. Um, it's probably one of the best things about not living in a city just being able to travel five ten minutes out the road and you're at a mountain range or you're at a big green area that you can go and have some you time which is what people need you time too many people are getting worried and worked up over the smallest of things because they don't take the time out of their day to go and think about themselves stuff that they need to know or stuff that they need to think about clear their head get some fresh air too many people are sitting on screens when they're on their downtime especially working if you're working with laptops or working with computers 
you sit all day, eight hours, nine hours, looking at a screen, and then for your downtime, what you want to do to relax, you go and you sit on your phone or on your laptop at home, or in front of a TV, and people just need air. It's one of the most underrated things in this world, just taking time to clear your head, especially with mental health these days, guys. If you feel yourself getting down, get out and have some new time. Leave the phone at home, leave everything at home, and just get out and get some new time. Come to a space like this, and just walk and think. If you want, stick in your earphones. Just to clear you, if you want to not be thinking about anything at all, if you have stuff on your mind and you just want to listen to music. Trust me, it will benefit you. Until you do it, you won't realize it. Come up, you can come up by yourself or with a friend. Probably the best thing to do, come up with a friend and even just talk out your problems or avoid talking about your problems. And just have time where you're not worried about getting somewhere. You're not worried about going and doing something. All you're worried about is the moment. Do it. That is a lovely, lovely walk if anyone's interested in doing it. How to get to it is you go past the Sportsman, Sportsman will be on your right, the Sportsman's pub, and it's the next left. So you go across the motorway over a bridge, and then t less than 30 seconds up that road, there'll be a wee gap to get in, and you park your car there and just walk it up. Lovely walk, lovely, lovely walk. So tonight we're going to watch. The Bad Boys for Life movie, the new one that's out. Um, obviously, I won't be able to video it, um, but I will give you my opinion on it. If if you're not interested in my opinion, I will give you a spoiler alert. Don't worry. So if you're not interested, or if you don't want to know about the movie, whenever I am talking about it, I will give you a spoiler alert. So I'm going to play the PlayStation for an hour later. Just finished the Bad Boys movie. Very, very good. Well worth a watch. For those of you who are wondering, you do not need to know the first two movies to go and see it. So you don't have to watch the first two to know what's going to happen in the third one. It's a completely different storyline. You don't need to. You don't need to, but it'd but be it good helps. if you knew it. Because you know a few there different- There'll inside yeah, jokes and there's, stuff. There are inside jokes, but you wouldn't need to know it to go and watch the full movie. Um, if you haven't seen them. Watch you them live anyway. under a rock. Yeah, watch them, they're good. So yeah, the, the storyline that they went with was one I didn't think they'd go with. No, that was a big twist. Yeah, a big twist at the end, which is very good. I'm going to try not to spoil you anything. Said it. Yeah, I'm going to try not to say anything. Uh, yeah, the whole storyline was kind of a continuation on from the second movie, but you don't need to really know it because you'll pick up what, this, what the storyline is about retirement and different stuff. But... What, I didn't spoil anything No, there. you didn't. No, I didn't spoil anything there. I'm trying not to spoil anything. If I do spoil anything, you'll see it come across the bottom of the screen. Spoiler alert coming up. Um, <laughs> so yeah, the whole storyline is about just them in a bit of trouble, getting out of it, 
but it's very very good watch it well worth the watch it was funny it was funny yeah I, very like it had the humor the whole way through it wasn't all well it was all action but it had humor in it even in the action parts so it's very very good what's up guys thanks for taking time out of your day for watching my vlog make sure you like and subscribe more content coming up boom